went across the River Jordan was like this wide. All right, let's get some gimbal. It's good. What's the problem? Oh, you passed. That's like a tour, basically. I'm back up here. That's where all the buses and stuff go. Oh, okay. And then from there, shuttle buses go there. Ah. Uh, right. I saw the road and I thought, let's, let's go. Okay. Yes, we try. International borders. Hey, guys. Hey, guys, do you want to shuttle bus? Maybe that one. I don't know. He's waiting. I think he's waiting for the people. Ghetto bus, guys. Ghetto bus. Yeah, I think he earned his bus. Ghetto bus. Ghetto bus. Ghetto bus. Ghetto bus. Ghetto bus. Our bus is making that color. Ghetto bus. This is the border right here. So this is Jordan, this is Israel. And you can see the army kind of protecting their land. <laughs> We're here at the baptismal site of John the Baptist. Back in his day, the river would have been about a kilometer wide. But today, it's just a little stream because they take all the water for irrigation. Irrigation, they siphon it off. Jesus did not just start his ministry when he felt like it, but the time that he should start was outlined prophetically in Daniel chapter 9. He made the 70 mile, 120 kilometer journey from Nazareth down here to this site in the river Jordan. Prophetically in Daniel chapter 9, verse 24 to 27. When the time came, 70 mile, 120 kilometer journey down here to this site in the river Jordan. Very good. Cameras in back. Yes, the big ones. Big ones. This. The Bible account records that he begged earnestly that they wouldn't be cast out of the country. There was a herd of 2,000 swine, pigs on the hillside, and they asked to be cast into them. A request that Jesus granted, and panic seized the herd, and they rushed madly down the cliff into the lake below. We are here in Gadara, in uh, Jordan. I don't even know what the local name is. Gadarenes, when Jesus healed the two demoniacs, two demoniacs, um, who, they were from the Gadarenes area. This is like, I guess you say the capital of the area. Over there, we could see the Sea of Galilee. The sea of Galilee might have been slightly higher back then, but uh, exactly where the cliffs are, the pigs went over, we're not quite sure, somewhere that way. And uh, it's a pretty cool story. They were told to go back and witness to their friends and family. So. Maybe those two demon possessed came through these roads and witnessed to their friends and family. Whoa. That's why I didn't want to walk down to the Dead Sea, right? Like that. <laughs> well, there was, no, there's two cops. Spread out, basically. So yeah. yeah. They didn't look that suspicious. It probably looked more suspicious. At the time, Israel was in deep sin and apostasy, and instead of worshipping God, they were worshipping Baal. This troubled Elijah greatly, and the time came when God told him to go to the king's palace and deliver a warning of judgment. Ghetto bus.